Hey, if you've ever had to disable the firewall to troubleshoot a problem, hit that subscribe button. I'm Lex from PDQ.com. I'm going to take you through how to build an uninstall package using inventory. I know, inventory to build a deploy package. It's kind of cool. So let's say you're cruising, perusing through, you know, machines and what they've got installed on there. And let's say I'm looking at the machine bird person and, hey, you know, they shouldn't have 7-zip or they shouldn't have Chrome. I'll show you both of these because they're a little different. You can right click on 7-zip and you can say uninstall and it's going to open a remote command window to run that uninstall on that machine. Now, like any of the deploy packages or anything you run in the background, it needs to run silently. So you need to Google and say, you know what? What's the silent uninstall parameters? That's it. Okay. I could run that, but if I wanted to uninstall 7-zip on everybody, it'd be much easier to build a package for that. So let's do that. I'm going to right click. I'm going to say create uninstall package. What it's going to do is going to take that uninstall string from inventory. There you go. And it's going to copy it over to a command step. And there it is, the exact same thing. Now remember, you need to do this silently. So that uninstall string parameter that I or that silent parameter for that uninstall string I was telling you about needs to go there so that's building that's an exe let me just show you uninstalling a msi package so I'm going to go back to bird person we're going to uninstall we're going to right click and create a uninstall package for chrome now if we look at that right msi silent parameters for msis are universal um, so it's really easy a front slash qn for quiet a no restart and then you'll notice this string, this identifier right there. The one thing you do need to know about a lot of MSIs is depending on versions and depending on your manufacturer, that may only work for certain versions of, in this case, Chrome or the software that's installed. So just be sure you test before you send it out. But that's how you do it, guys. Right click, create uninstall package, add your silent parameters, or if it's an MSI, verify that it's gonna uninstall you know, generically or just go after the, the versions that you need to remove. Thank you for watching. I'm Mike from PDQ.com.